Hey, so this will be part of the uh, subscribers questions answered Monday series. Had a subscriber ask about anchoring up and specifically the anchor well, which is under me at the moment. But um, in order to film that, see what kind of drain system it has, we need to drop the line. And we're in a spot where we've dropped a crab pot. There's a lot of other ones around here. So what I'm going to do is unhitch the anchor and uh, we're going to let it out and then let out the uh, the rope that's attached to it and uh, show you what's in there. So the way mine's rigged up, we have the actual anchor line and you can see some of this uh, bright green paint which is on here every 10 foot up until the 100 foot mark. After the 100 foot mark, it goes to, I believe, a bright orange. Um, much smaller gauge chain than I have. This one that is around the cleat it is strictly here for holding the anchor on, right? So this one, like the one that actually goes through the windlass, um, has no tension on it at all. Also have a... Uh, you see the bungee cord holding things in. So when we're ready to drop anchor, I will come to the front and pull that pin. And you'll see now this chain is totally loose from the, oh, and I just lost, um, well, this has been a day of losing stuff, let me tell you. <laughs> we have lost a ultralight fishing rod and reel. Um, we've lost a crab pot. Um, lost a beverage that was setting on the gun wall that went over. So we'll just chalk up my uh, bungee strap to another loss of the day. But anyway, if I can film this somewhat here we'll pull this and then I just cinch this thing back down tight while we're waiting here and then at this point anchors loose I'm ready to drop so I'll let my buddy know we're ready to go ahead and drop it and let it go down dropping out the green paint. There's the orange paint. So I'm gonna signal my uh, buddy to stop the drop and go inside and film the rest from the actual anchor well itself. Back in the boat, looking into the anchor well, and uh, go ahead and hit it.
drainage uh, from the anchor well is we just pulled up to the actual stopper knot and you can see setting on mine it's all dripping water. And if you look down here, it looks like we have water which would have come on through like some of the uh, ballast ports. Uh, you want to hit the uh, bilge pump up there? So we're going to hit the bilge pump to see if this drains out. So I've had to reach to even get this camera up in here because I don't have the mats in at the moment. But uh, you know, once the uh, film footage comes out here, you'll see exactly what there is down in there. So I'll be kind of anxious to see myself. But uh, you now knowing that the rope that came up at the final end here was wet, I'm guessing that it goes down into the base of the hole. So we'll uh, see you a little later. <laughs> 